Welcome back to the Chronicles of Aguna, brought to you by Loserpool.com. As ever, I'm your host, Harry Simu, and on this edition, we'll be looking ahead to the clash with Sporting Lisbon this evening in the UEFA Europa League. Now, it is just a short video. I have to stress that um, just to give you a quick update on the team news and uh, uh, give you my prediction, of course, for this evening's game. Now, in terms of team news, uh, Unai Emery provided us with some updates in his press conference yesterday. And this is what he had to say. At the moment, we continue to have injuries for Mavropanos and Koscielny. In terms of Koscielny, he said this. He is getting better. He is training with us. So positive news on that front, uh, of course. Now, Nacho Monreal will also be absent. Uh, he's been left out of the group for this evening's game. And, and when asked why... Unai Emery had this to say. Uh, we are taking precautions with him because we don't want to repeat the same injury. He is starting to train, but not doing all with us. He isn't in the group for tomorrow. Uh, so obviously Emery is worried about his condition. I think he recognizes what a vital component Nacho Monreal is um, to this side and, and has been to the success of late. So I guess he, he doesn't feel it's worth taking the risk at the moment. Now, just going back to Lauren Koscielny, because this did come up in the press conference once again. Um, Emery was was pressed to try and give a, a date as to when he thought the Frenchman would return to action. And he had this to say, the most important thing is how he's feeling every day. He can feel better each training session with us. He's closer to being with us in competitive games. But at the moment, we are calm. We are happy with him and he is feeling well. I think he is getting better every day. And after the international break, we're going to have to think about how we're going to start him playing games. So uh, he set a bit of a milestone there. After the international break is when Emery will be looking to try and integrate him properly uh, into the match day squads. Uh, but, you know, with an, an injury as severe as that and, and as serious as that, you do have to be careful. And so uh, I don't feel there's an, a, a desperate need to rush him back at this moment in time. I think we're all right. Um, and, and the main thing is Lauren Koscielny's fitness. He's been a great servant to Arsenal Football Club and, and the least we can do is is be patient with him. Now, Emery was also asked on whether being one, aw one win sorry, away from qualification will make a difference to who he plays against Sporting and his response was as follows. Of course, the first mind for us is to finish first in the group. Tomorrow is a very important match because it is against the second team in the table. And if we win, we're first in the group. So Unai Emery, of course, placing importance on this game like he has done throughout this tournament. We've seen that he's willing to uh, take his full squad wherever it may be, even if it's a, a long trip to Azerbaijan. That doesn't phase him. Unai Emery is making sure that this squad is united and that everybody plays the part. And I guess covering his ass so that, you know, if we are found wanting in a game, he has got options from the bench. I think Arsene Wenger was very adamant on having two separate squads. And I think that that caused us a problem, um, particularly when we had injuries in the first team. And some of those Europa League squad members were being asked to move across and, and backfill. It, it just got messy. And, and so for me, one squad, one ambition, one goal. That's the way to go. And, and that's what we've seen from Unai Emery so far. Um, I think he will select a strong team tonight, if I had to guess. Um, I think... People like Danny Welbeck will probably get a game, which is good. He's, he's our top scorer, I believe, in the Europa League. Um, and he's impressed uh, a lot this season, it has to be said. So I think we'll see some changes, but I also think Emery will find the right balance between strength and giving some players a break. Because don't forget, we've got a very important Premier League game against a very handy Wolverhampton Wanderers side this coming Sunday. That's a 4.30 p.m. kickoff. Our preview for that will be coming out tomorrow which is friday um so as we're not you know crossing games here it's let's deal with sporting first and then we'll deal with wolves uh so check out uh look out sorry for that uh that'll be coming across to you guys very very shortly um my prediction for this evening is arsenal 2 sporting nil um and i think Welbeck will bag a brace tonight i've got that kind of feeling that guy Welbs is going to produce the goods so 
Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Of course, uh, feel free to comment whatever you like, but I'd like to see some of your predictions and maybe some of your predicted starting 11s uh, if you're feeling brave. And of course, you can tweet us at Chronicles underscore AFC. Please, please, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Um, I know compared to some YouTube channels, our subscriber number it is not very high, but you know what? We're on the up and, and I think we've gained uh, over 150 subscribers in this last month and... and you know, it might not seem a lot to everyone, but for me, uh, that's that's amazing, and I'm really grateful. So, spread the word, subscribe, like, share, do what you gotta do, and uh, we'll speak again on the other side.